a lot of people sleep on, Carry on, on Johnson. Kenny, yeah. A lot of a lot of people sleep on him and uh and yeah, like I said, thirty three, uh Johnson, uh he, he's a beast. He's a beast. So that offensive line as a group is uh is tough. Pretty good offensive line too. Correct. Yeah. Correct. They invested a lot into the offensive line, uh, you know, whether it was draft picks. I know they got a new a new center last year. Uh, he played guard and, and now they put him at his original position. Uh, so they, they they invested into the offensive line. Uh, they got you know the, the left tackle Decker. Mm -hmm. They invested into him. So uh, they got a lot of good players. And, and and like I said, like Matthew Stafford, he didn't seen it all. He didn't been through it all. Uh, you know he can make all the big time throws. Has a big arm. So uh, he's a, he's a great player. That um, and it's a team that uh, we got to be ready for a four quarter battle for yeah. sure. All right, now you don't have to face him, but have you talked to Mike Daniels at all? Nah, I ain't, not I ain't at talk. all. <laughs> I talked. Well, I, I spoke to him uh, after after we played the Vikings. I spoke to him, but okay. um, that, that's really I haven't spoke to him uh, mm -hmm. since then. You just give him a hug at least when you see him on Sunday after the after game. The, yeah, 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 I mean after yeah, the game, right? After the game, before the game. I, if, if I see him, yeah, I give him a hug. Well, he's going to have so. a chip on his shoulder. You know, Mike. You know how Mike is. <laughs> yeah. He's got. He's gonna. He's gonna be barking. Oh yeah, yeah. I mean, I, I mean, I'm gonna love to see it. You know, I'm excited to to uh, see him come back to Lambeau. Uh, it's gonna be a good time. So. Yeah. Uh, of our offense, you know, show them what's up. Yeah, yeah. And Monday night, uh, all your family back home on the West Coast going to have a chance to watch it. Oh yeah, for sure. Yeah, it's it's a big game. It's a big game, and uh, you know, whoever whoever wins this game is going to be in first place in the division. Uh, so um, it's a big game. Yep. You know, finally, it's been a couple of years since you've been on the show, and guys talk about their foundations and their charities. I still think the Angel Tree program that you're involved with is one of the coolest things ever. Mm -hmm. yeah. Tell folks about what, that, what that's yeah. about. That's, I mean, it's just a really neat thing. Yeah, so um, um, my dad, he's, he's incarcerated. Uh, so Angel Tree, they work with kids that, uh, that have incarcerated parents and um, they, give, got, they give kids you know, presents or uh, you know, on their birthdays, Christmas. Uh, they make sure that, that um, families aren't really broken up, you know, even though that their kids, I mean, their parents are in, uh, in prison. And I, I've been doing a lot of stuff with that, and uh, I've just been trying to take uh, some of the lessons that they, they, that they have uh, gave to me and uh, incorporated it into like, what I do personally just for um, you know, my city. You know, I do uh, Christmas giveaways, and uh, this year I'm going to do a turkey drive out here in Green Bay. So right. nice. um, you know, I'm just trying to you know, do my best to uh, just give back. Right. Kenny, one of the toughest uh, zip codes in the United States is 53203. Uh, down in Milwaukee, uh, there's a lot of incarceration down there. So I have a chance to, to get back to Milwaukee every weekend. Well, this guy also was just there last Tuesday building houses with a right. bunch oh, of the yeah. other guys on the team. How cool is that? Man, that, 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 was, a, um, that was a different experience. Yep. Um, I, like just, we were building like a, a park basically and um, it was it was different. Just you know, you grow up as a kid. And, you know, you just see this big park. Yep. Uh, you see the slides and all that stuff, and you know, uh, just to be out there, and uh, you know, seeing you know how how people you know make it and you know what they do, and then uh, just to see the whole community come together and you know do that. Yep. Um, you know, it's pretty cool. Very yeah. cool. All, all right, right. Reggie real quick. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Reggie Wood for sure. Reggie We're Wood. running out of time. We're gonna renew your green and gold really quick. Most famous non-athlete you know. You're from L.A. Most famous non-athlete? Yeah. Any actors and actors, actresses that you might have hung out with? Nah, I don't know. No, none. that ain't your crowd. Nah, that ain't my crowd. <laughs> all right. These ones are all real simple. Mustard or ketchup? Ketchup. Brat or burger? Brat. You're a wrestling state champion. Fake wrestling. Do you follow WWE? Yes. Who's your guy? My guy. Uh, I'm gonna go with uh, I'm gonna go with the fiend. The fiend. The fiend. I Bray Wyatt. I have no <laughs> idea. I have no yeah, idea. Yeah, he's, <laughs> he's a beast. He, he like he kind of like new right now. He's a new guy. All right. Yeah, We're I, stuck in the Hulk Hogan, Hogan know, Andre yeah, the Giant yeah. era. All right. <laughs> when we come back, we'll have questions from the crowd in the Oneida One Stop Fan Zone for Kenny Clark and George Cooper.